Hey everybody, today we're going to go over how to create a radial style logo with the case study of BP. This example here has an analogous color scheme, yellow, kind of green yellow to green. Here's the original BP logo. Here's what we'll be making uh, with the simple kind of radial effect, creating vector art uh, for this logo. Okay. First thing you want to do, go ahead and go to File New. Click OK. I'm going to go to View, Hide Artboards. Let me just work with this here. And go ahead and select the pen tool. So click, and then see how it kind of turns in that little red line? That means it's 90 degree angle right above it. Click, and then drag to kind of create a curve here, like so. All right. Now, Go ahead and select the selection tool, black arrow on the toolbar. Hold down Alt on the PC or Command on the Mac and click and drag. I'll hold Shift so it's at that 90 degree angle. All right, so we've just duplicated that. Then you can right click over it and go to Transform and then Reflect. Just make sure vertical is selected and uh, click OK. Then we'll move that right back so it's meeting that right there, the original one. Select the direct selection tool, the white arrow, click and drag around this both area up here, and then right click, join. Do the same thing on the bottom, right click, join. All right, so we, now we have our basic shape. What we want to do is make sure this is selected. Move in here so we can see it better. Choose the rotate tool right here. Hold down Alt on the PC, Option on the Mac, and just click. And angle should be 20 degrees, and just click Copy. And then immediately, without deselecting, press Control D on the PC or Command D on the Mac. And earlier when I said Command, I think I meant Option. Uh, when you want to duplicate, do Option on the Mac, Alt on the PC, all right, if I said that. So anyway, Command-D on the Mac, Control-D on the PC. You have this kind of pattern right here, right? Now, click and drag around all of it. And we need to just set the stroke here, the border, to None. So click that, and then click the None right below it. And then the fill up here, you can change it to a different color if you want to do a different one compared to the original or if you do want the original what you can do I'll show you in a second but um, just sure, make sure you have the stroke set to none and then some kind of fill now click and drag around all of it right that like so with one of the arrows open up the Pathfinder palette just go to window then Pathfinder and then click this first Pathfinder effect here divide then also go to object then ungroup all right. now we need to paint all these different colors what you can do is if you you can copy and paste the BP logo from Google Images if you want just search for BP logo um, and I, I'm just gonna click and drag around all of that if you want the exact colors click the the eyedropper tool there choose that dark green then hold down shift and click on all of these little radial shapes here and we're going to set this to that kind of yellow green hue. All right. So again, you can choose your own color if you want, or if you want that exact one, just use the eyedropper tool. Do something like that. And then this last pattern here in the middle. Just a quick and easy way to make a similar pattern here. And choose that yellow. All right. The last step, you could go in and make that white in the middle. What I like to do is actually, um, oops, let me recolor that. Just alt click or option click on the Mac. So I duplicate this and then set that to zero. And we can put this right in the center there. 
but we're going to rotate it. Whoops. Just rotate it slightly. And you can bring it in, make it a little bit smaller. And that original one, all right. And then you'd also want to get rid of those the green ones in the center as well. But it's a similar quick technique. Um, if you want to create a similar pattern, you can experiment with this and come up with different color schemes. Of course, if you want to change it, you know, to blue, and then change the inside uh, patterns to other hues as well. Just a quick way to create a similar look of the BP logo. Thanks.